And now, please welcome two-time Academy Award winner, Kevin Spacey. I am incredibly delighted to be here tonight as my friend Al Pacino gets his honor. It's my pleasure to teach all of you in this audience <laughs> how to do the perfect Al Pacino impression in three easy steps. One, where did it go? I, I call this step, where did it go? Because Al always seems to be looking for something that he's lost. <laughs> now, he, he doesn't necessarily know what it is, but he still can't find it. So, because you're all sitting, I'm gonna sit and help you to learn how to do this. So, so, you have to start by searching for something that has gone missing. Where is it? My wallet, my, my passport, my toothbrush, my lines, my performance. Whoa, where did that go? Step two is the surprise. Al, for some reason, always looks a little surprised. If you look at his face, it's like, what just happened? <laughs> the last thing I remember, I was snorting a wheelbarrow full of cocaine in Scarface, and now I'm sitting next to the president. Whoa, how did that happen? <laughs> and then finally, step three is the huff. Whoa. Al seems to have a lot of air. <laughs> He's got to get it out. Whoa! Hoo -ha. I blow it out, but it just comes right back in. <laughs> Look, the reason that all of us love to do an impersonation of Al Pacino is because he has created characters that are unforgettable. And that's because for Al Pacino, it's not just business. It's not just business. It's craft. And I've been fortunate to know him a long time and work with him. I adore you. Congratulations, my friend. Roll the film. Thank you so much.